How you doing? Good, how you doing, bro? Pretty good, what do you have here? So I have a page and a couple other little documents from the famous Breaches Bible from 1594. Whoa. I'm not very good at reading Old English, but you could read that if you wanted to try. <laughs> yeah, go, you, talk, you, you try, I can't. So I'm at the pawn shop today trying to sell a page out of the famous Breaches Bible from 1594. I acquired this from my parents. They got it about 25 years or so ago. It came to me, and I don't have no use for it, so that's why I brought it here to see what we can do with it. I'm hoping to get 5,000 for my page from the Breaches Bible from 1594. This is pretty cool. There's many different versions of the Bible. The Bible we know today is the King James Bible. And I do believe that this Bible actually was outlawed when King James decided, I'm gonna print my version of the Bible and this is what I want you guys to read. But this was a very popular Bible and this is the first Bible that came over with the first people to settle in America. People liked it because of these little scriptures on the side explaining things to people that weren't just scholars. You know, your everyday person could read this and understand it. There was a time when the Roman Catholic Church didn't want the Bible printed in any other language than Latin because the church felt that the Bible is something that should be taught by the church and that individual people shouldn't be reading the Bible themselves. Oh, wow. There was a big movement in Europe and everyone decided that they would print Bibles in their native language and a lot of people didn't like that. So, you know, half of Europe it was legal and the other half it wasn't. So how much are you looking to get for it? I'm trying to look to get five grand. All right, um, I'm looking at it thinking maybe it could be worth money, maybe it couldn't. I know once before here, my boss has even paid $40,000 for one page out of the Bible. But the thing is with Bibles, it is the most printed book ever. And even some of these older prints aren't worth very much money because this would have been the bread and butter of the print shops back then. But, I mean, I really have no idea. It could be worth five grand, it could be worth 500 grand. I really don't know. I'd like to have someone come down and take a look at it. And then we can talk about a price after I have it authenticated and verified. Awesome, sounds great to me. All right, well, let me get her down here and um, she will give us her, her holy word on it. Cool, can't wait, excited, thank you. I'm hoping the expert says that it's authentic and hopefully it's worth more than $5,000. I get a lot more tattoos.